Hey guys, welcome to part two of my lip product declutter. In my last video, I did declutter 93 items, so that is where we left off. So um, next, I will be going through all of my bullet lipsticks. I did want to apologize in advance. I was experiencing quite a lot of technical difficulties with both my lighting and my camera. So I tried to make up for that by filming uh, some still shots too. So I will be adding some of those in, but I do apologize up front. This did take me two full hours to film so my lighting kept changing as I was going along so um, I hope you guys enjoy watching if you have questions or comments leave them below bye guys all right last but not least let's get into these lipsticks all right so first of all I have this little pile of lipstick here which is um, stuff that was like overflow in my lip drawer because it just didn't fit all in there um, I have this little set uh, from Un mineral fusion I don't like the formula on these they're just too sheer and I just don't I don't like working with them, so I'm going to declutter all three of those. Um, I have these baby Marc Jacobs lipsticks. I have two shades. One is Kiss Kiss Bang Bang, and the other is Boy, Boy Gorgeous. I love Marc Jacobs' formula. I'm keeping both of those for sure. They're just really, really nice. All right, so next I have all of these Wet n Wild ones. I really like the formula on these Wet n Wild. Let me just check these shades that I've got. You know, I feel like I'm gonna go ahead and keep all of these because I like the formula and I do wear them and they're also really great for dupes videos. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep these. All right, next I have two Baby Kat Von D lipsticks. I have Lolita and Cathedral. I do love both of these shades, so I am gonna keep those too. And I'm definitely keeping this little baby which is called um, Celebr Celebutard. I'm almost done using that guy up, so I definitely want to keep that. I have this Sephora Collection lipstick. Um, this is the shade my kids bought me in my Kids Buy My Makeup Challenge, and it's fun, but I just don't wear that bright orange, so I'm going to declutter that. I also have this NYX um, High Voltage lipstick. This is a really nice nude shade, so I will go ahead and keep that one. And I have this High Voltage in... That's a really nice color, so I will keep that as well. I have these Princessa lipsticks. These are really cool colors, but I just never reach for these, so I'm gonna go ahead and declutter both of them. They're really cool colors, though. Like, that color right there, oh, geez. I feel like I need to wear that now that I just watched that. Look how cool. It's almost, like, iridescent. All right, I'm gonna wear this, so I'm gonna keep that one. This one, I'm gonna go ahead and declutter. So next I have um, this one. I never, I don't think I've ever worn that. I'm gonna go ahead and declutter that as well. That's from the Shop Massey side also. I have two of these uh, Kate Rimmel lipsticks. I just never reach for those anymore. Those are both gonna go. I have this Pacifica lipstick. I did not like this one, so that's gonna go. I have this one from Rimmel. That color is just too light for me. I'm gonna get rid of that. And then I have this Smashbox one. What is this? This is in the shade Melindrama. I like that color, so I'm gonna keep that one. All right, let's do this next round. Oh my goodness, you guys. This Romand lipstick, I really like this color a lot. It's a really, really pretty corally pink. I'm definitely keeping that. I have this one here from CoverGirl, one of these kitty cat ones. These are nice. These are nice, but I don't know. I never reach for them. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of both of them. I just don't reach for them. I have one more in here. This is an e.l.f. one I did not like. It's just no color to it, so that I'm going to get rid of as well. And then let's do, should we do the MAC ones first? Yeah, let's do the MAC ones first, and then we'll get into all these Urban Decay. So these are all my MAC lipsticks right here. Um, so first, this one is called Pink Plaid. I love Pink Plaid. This is a really, really pretty color. So that I'm going to keep. Next I have um, Long Legged and Fabulous. This is one of my favorite colors too. Oh gosh, I just love the formula on these. These are going to be hard for me. I have Stone. This is the gray one I told you guys I wanted to keep. I feel like this is better than the Smashbox one. It's more wearable for me. So I'm going to keep that. I'm steady Going. I'm going to keep that one. And then I have Sweet and Sour. This is one of my favorites. I'm definitely keeping that. It's a very unique color. This is also one of my favorites. This is Oxblood. That's not going anywhere. And then I have um, Steam Heat. Steam Heat, I really like this, but I never, ever wear it. So I am going to go ahead and let go of that one. I really like it, though, but I just don't wear it. And then I have Smoked Purple. So this is, this is a shade I don't wear either. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that. It's so beautiful, but I just don't wear it. Next I have Shy Girl. This is one of my, my ultimate favorites that's staying. And then I have Ravishing. Let me check this one. Oh my gosh, my camera wasn't filming. Okay, 
what did I just do? Hold on. I decided to get rid of Pervet because this is a color I don't wear. It's like a really pretty kind of frosty, really pretty color. I just don't wear that. So I'm getting rid of that. I did decide to keep Pervet. And then I'm also keeping this one which is Costa Chic. Sorry, my camera, it keeps shutting down. I don't know what it's doing, but it keeps turning itself off. And my lighting sucks, but I really have to get through this. So I'm uh, fighting some fighting the lighting and fighting the camera today, but I have a few of these kind of purpley colors that I wanted to compare. This is Have Your Cake. This one here was, oh, what did I do with it? I got them all mixed up now. Hold on. Is that heroin? No, this is heroin. Let me swatch these next to each other. That's heroin. What was that other one? Up the Amp. Okay, so this is Up the Amp. This is Have Your Cake. This is heroin. Okay, and then I also have Rebel. Okay. I really like this Rebel. I'm gonna keep that one. That is a really pretty berry. And then of these three, which one do I feel like I would wear more? I just don't wear a lot of purples, but I really like this one, which is Have Your Cake. I don't I don't think I'm gonna wear heroin. I just don't think I will. I'm gonna get rid of heroin. I know it's a classic matte color, but I just don't wear that color. And then I think I'll keep these other two. Okay. And then I have Giddy. This is a really pretty color. Oh, it's melted. It melted. Ah, time to get rid of that. And then I also have Candy Yum Yum. This is one I used to love, but I just don't wear this kind of color anymore, that like fluorescent pink, so that's gonna go. And then I have Girl About Town. This is another color I used to absolutely love. I feel like I would wear that one though, so I'm gonna keep that. And then um, Snob I'm definitely keeping. This is like um, one of my all time favorites. It still smells good, so I'm going to go ahead and keep that. I love that color. And then I have Creme de Nude, and this is just a classic, and I definitely really, really like that one. I'm going to keep it. That's bad, but I'm going to do it. All right, let's move on to all of these Urban Decay ones, because I really need to get this done before this light goes away. Um, here's another one. So I have some of the newer ones. These are their newer uh, formula. Um, this is one of my favorite, which is, uh, oh wait, this is Violet. Yeah, I really like Violet. That's kind of like a purpley color. Oh geez, look how much it looks like that. Really hard. I don't like this. You know, that's really close to that one. So I'm going to keep the MAC one. I'm going to get rid of Violet, even though that's kind of new. Um, I have 714. This is a pretty color. I didn't keep a lot of red so far, so I will keep that one. I also have Back Talk. This is my favorite. That's staying. Okay, and then I have the old Revolution ones, Streak. This is a pretty, pretty color. That is really pretty, but this is really similar to a lot of those MAC ones I kept, so I'm going to get rid of that one. And then I have this one here, which is called Stark, uh, Stark Naked. I really like this one. That I'm going to keep. And then I have this one, which is Sheer Anarchy. This is a sheer, really pretty pink color, but I don't wear that color, so that I'm going to get rid of. And then I have uh, Native. That one's really pretty, that I'm gonna keep. Okay, I have 1993, the old one, which is darker than their new one, I don't know why. Their new one is not as dark, but I really like that, so I'm gonna keep that. And then I have Bittersweet, this is one I don't wear. This is another purple. Look at that, look how similar that is. I'm gonna get rid of Bittersweet for sure. Don't need that anymore. And then I have Anarchy, this is not the sheer one, this is just the regular Anarchy. Definitely not a color I wear anymore. That I can get rid of. And then I have Obsessed. This is a really nice color. This is a color I do wear, so that one I am going to keep. And then last one is Fiend, and this is another really good color that I will wear, so that I will keep as well. Whew, okay. Now I have one more of these Lancome lipsticks. This is a really pretty color. Um, this is called Newt and Jour, I think. But you know what? <sighs> That's so basic. I feel like I have so many other lip colors like that. I'm gonna get rid of that, okay. All right, all right. Next, I have this Givenchy lipstick. This is really cool packaging, but the lipstick itself, it's just not that great of a color. It's like a sheer red, and if I'm gonna do red, I wanna go all the way with the red, you know? So that I'm gonna declutter. Um, I have more of these NARS lipsticks. This one is in the shade Anna. This is my favorite that I'm keeping. I have this lipstick from Revlon, which I think I've worn one time. I just, I don't wear that color. That's gonna go. I have this Buxom one in the shade Sinful Cinnamon. This is a great color, but honestly, I have so many like that. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that one. 
I really like that lipstick though, you guys. I'm surprised I did that, but I have so many like that. Then I have this Estee Lauder. This is a really pretty berry color. I don't have very many that I kept in that shade, so I feel like I can go ahead and keep that. This is a Laura Mercier lipstick in French Kiss. I have a lot of pinks like that, so I'm going to get rid of that one. This is a Revlon lipstick in Sassy Mauve. This I've had forever, and I have a lot like that one. I'm going to go ahead and declutter that. I have this little baby Bobbi Brown lipstick. This came in a kit. I like that color. I will keep that. It's pretty new. I have a Marc Jacobs lipstick. This is in Goddess. This is one of my absolute favorite reds. It's just such a great red, so I am going to keep that one as well. All right, next I have some of these Milani lipsticks. I really like the formula of these, and I really like all these shades. I'm going to get rid of this one, though, because I have a lot just like that. That's a very common shade for me, um, so I don't need that anymore. It's really pretty, though. It's matte naked. I love that one. I just don't need it. And then I have Innocence, I feel like. Yeah, Innocence is another shade I have a lot of like that, so I'm going to get rid of that. But these two are unique enough. I'm going to keep it, so that's the Blissful and Brandy. I'm going to keep those. Next, I have this mud lipstick. This color, I just don't, I don't need that. I have a lot of colors like that, and it doesn't look that good on me. And then I have this e.l.f. one I've had forever, and I just don't wear it ever, so I'm going to get rid of it. It's pretty. I just don't ever wear it. I'm going to save these for a little bit, because there's a lot of those to go through. Let's go through this little category next. I have another Sephora lipstick that I love this one. I'm going to keep that one. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of all of these Victoria's Secret ones now. These are just super old, and I just, I mean, I'm ready to get rid of them. That was three, and then two more, so that's five I'm getting rid of. Um, here is another Wet n' Wild lipstick. This is in the flesh. I didn't even realize I had another one of these. Um, that's a color I don't need. I'm going to get rid of it. This Eve Pearl lipstick is super pretty. I just um, have colors like that, and I never reach for it, so I'm going to get rid of that. This CoverGirl one, I never, ever reach for. I'm going to get rid of that. Um, this Rimmel one is very, very pretty. I really like the formula, but I have a lot like that. So I am going to get rid of that. Next, I have this is a Hikari lipstick I never reach for. That can go. This Rimmel one is going to go as well. This Bite lipstick in the shade Molasses. I don't like that color. I'm going to get rid of it. Here's another Sephora lipstick. Oh, man, I, I get these from work a lot. This is a red I don't wear. I'm going to get rid of it. Next, I have this Marc Jacobs lipstick in Sonic Truth. This is one of my favorite nude lipsticks. I'm keeping that. Uh, all right, next, I have this old Lancome lipstick. I've had a long time. It's beautiful, but I'm going to get rid of that. I also have this Stila lipstick, which I've had a long time, and it is time for that to go. I have this Julie Hewitt lipstick. It's very pretty, but I have a lot of colors like that, so I'm going to get rid of that because the formula was okay. This Lipstick Queen lipstick, I did not like this color. I'm going to get rid of that. I also have another Lancome one. This is the Berry Noir. This is a color I don't have a lot of, so I will keep that. I love this Charlotte Tilbury lipstick. This is in Bitch Perfect. I'm keeping that. Another one of these NARS Audacious lipsticks in Anita. That's going to stay. This um, is a Too Faced lipstick. Oh, that's pretty. That I'm going to keep. That's a really pretty berry color. And this Cargo one I really, really like a lot. Um, I talked about this in one of my nude favorite, favorite nude lipsticks videos. Keeping that. All right. These NYX Max Matte... NYX Matte Lipsticks. I've had these for so long, and I just don't like the formula anymore, so I'm going to declutter all three of those. This B Bella Pierre lipstick is a really pretty shade, so I do actually want to keep that. Whew. And then I have one more Mud lipstick. This is in Mudslide. This one I liked. This was a brown color, but I liked that one, so that I will keep. All right, last but not least, let's go through these... First Bees lipsticks. I have way too many. They sent me the whole collection. I did get rid of a couple already, but I think I don't need all of these. So what I want to keep is I'm going to declutter the nude. I have a ton of nude lipsticks. Um, I like Tulip Tide. That was one of my favorites, so I will keep that. And this Birming, Brimming Berry I really liked. And then I want to keep one, the red. So I'm going to go with the Scarlet Scored. I'm going to get rid of Fuchsia Flood. I'm going to get rid of Lily Lake. I'm going to get rid of Russet River. I'm going to get rid of Blush Basin. And let's see, what are these? And I'm going to get rid of Suede Splash and keep Juniper Water. There we go, you guys. That's it. Let's count it up. Oh, my God. That took me like two hours. No joke. Okay, guys. Holy crap. I just counted them up. I have decluttered 154 lip products. 
That is insane. That is insane. Most people don't even own that many lip products. That is crazy. I, ugh, this collection has gotten out of control. Now, keep in mind, obviously, I do get a lot for free from work and from PR. So that just happens. It does just kind of accumulate over time. Um, but yeah, I'm really happy to see all of this move out of my collection and hopefully most of it will get a good new home. Not all of it. Some of it does have to be trashed, but um, a lot of this will find a new home. So thank you guys so much for watching this declutter today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.